Welcome to the Cloud Google Migrator from Cloud Technology Solutions. Today, we're going to migrate from GroupWise to Google Apps. The Cloud Google Migrator can take your Microsoft Exchange system or your Novell GroupWise system and migrate all data to Google Apps, including email, calendar, and contacts. Before we start the migration, let's have a look inside a user's GroupWise client. This particular version of GroupWise is GroupWise 7, but we also support GroupWise 6.5 through to GroupWise 8. Here we can see the user's inbox. If we have a look at this particular email, we can see it's an email with a body and with two attachments including an executable. We'll look at this email later once the migration to Google Apps has taken place. We will also be migrating the user's personal contacts to Google Apps, so let's have a look in there. In particular, let's examine this contact, and you can see we have the full name, email address, address, website, and telephone numbers for this contact. We'll have a look at this contact in Google Apps later on. Inside the user's calendar, we can see that the user actually has two calendars. The orange items are from a secondary calendar, and the grey items are from the user's primary calendar. This is the Cloud Google Migrator from Cloud Technology Solutions. As we are going to be migrating from GroupWise today, we need to change the migration platform to be GroupWise. Once this is done, we can go ahead and enter the details required to connect to the GroupWise system. We need the address, the domain distinguished name, the tree name, and a username of any user in the post office. We also need to enter the trusted application details. We provide a tool to help you create a trusted application within GroupWise. After completing the GroupWise settings, we can move on and complete the Google settings. We need the name of a domain administrator, the password, and the domain name we're going to be migrating to. We also need the consumer secret, and this can be obtained by logging into your Google Apps dashboard. Once logged into your Google Apps dashboard, you need to navigate to Advanced Tools and then to Manage OAuth Access. Inside this section, we need the value of the consumer secret, which we'll copy into the tool. Once these settings have been completed, we can move on to the Users tab and proceed to click the Get Users button. Now we have a list of the users that we're going to migrate to Google Apps. You can see the export name, the import name, the given name, the family name, password, archive path and the migration settings for each user. We're going to change the import name to something different than the export name. The import name is the login name of the user inside Google Apps. When we've completed these details, we can actually start the migration. Once we've hit the start button, the process begins. During the migration, the interface reports the status of all operations. As you can see, we're migrating two users here simultaneously. If you had a bigger migration, this could be scaled up as appropriately. The interface displays how many messages have been successfully exported from GroupWise.
and the status and the position in the import process. You can see now we're importing mail for both users into Google Apps. The migration process completed successfully for these two users. If there were any failures, they are clearly reported in the interface. As it is, let's have a closer look at those items that succeeded. At the end of every migration, detailed statistics are also written to disk. This ensures you have comprehensive information about the migration that was performed. Now the migration is complete, let's inspect one of the accounts inside Google Apps. Here we are inside the user's mailbox, and let's have a look at that message that we looked at in the GroupWise client earlier on. As you can see, the message contents are all there, and the two attachments that were in GroupWise. The executable has been renamed so as to allow import into Google Apps. Looking at the user's contacts, you can see the personal contacts have been migrated, and all the contact details have been brought across from GroupWise. Both of the user's calendars have been migrated, including all of the appointments therein. This video gives an overview of how to migrate from GroupWise to Google Apps using the Cloud Technology Solutions Cloud Google Migrator. The Cloud Google Migrator also supports migration from Exchange 2000 through to Exchange 2007. Thanks for watching, and for any more information, please visit our website.